If I'm going to stop this killer, I should analyze the body I found on the rooftop of the Gotham Herald. found a mutilated body, but this isn't the one Cash told me about. I'm going to try and establish a cause of death. Blood tests reveal the cause of death was an overdose of painkillers leading to cardiac arrest. Also, the victim's fingerprints have been burned off with acid. A rather unsavory demise. That's not all. It's as though the subject's DNA has been corrupted somehow. There's insufficient information for me to cross-reference the database. I'll have to use the deep tissue scanner to analyze the body for distinguishing features and determine the victim's identity. Right you are, sir. Scar tissue on the upper arm. I recognize the pattern. Twenty years ago, this was a badge of honor among inmates at Blackgate Penitentiary. A small group of racketeers known as the Bloodhaven Six. Remnants of a pacemaker fitted through the right ventricle. If I cross-reference the manufacturer with the pacing method, it will help to narrow the search. Clear signs of bone deformation on the victim's knee. Joint line sclerosis points to juvenile arthritis, a rare and debilitating condition. Alfred, I've ID'd the victim as Franklin Accardo. His records are a litany of drug-related offenses, sir. In and out of prison from an early age. He was serving a 20-year sentence at Blackgate before being released early on grounds of ill health due to a heart condition. He moved to Little Rock, Arkansas, which is where he was reported missing. What's unusual is that they didn't go missing in Gotham. They were brought here and killed. Why? We need to track down whoever did this. Might I suggest keeping an ear out for any more of that ghastly opera music? It sounds ominously like a calling card. I found another body. The mutilation pattern looks to be identical to the previous murder victim. Then it appears Gotham does indeed have a serial killer in its midst. And here I was thinking this evening couldn't get any worse. I'm going to scan the body for unique identifiers. Deformity on the left ear. 
Looks like a result of minor ear agenesis, a birth defect. A wedding ring in the lower intestine. The inscription reads, Ophelia. The victim had a hip replacement. Scar tissue hasn't fully healed, so it must have been recent. Alfred, the victim's name is Anthony Lund. Hospital records show he suffered with alcoholism, most probably brought on by the breakdown of his marriage. The name on the ring, Ophelia, his ex-wife. He was last seen in Albuquerque, New Mexico. Another person taken from outside the Gotham area. A significant detail, sir. So are these words written beside the bodies. Try and find a connection between the two victims I've found, Alfred. There has to be something linking them together. I'll try my best, sir. Someone's attacked the fire station in Bristol. I'm going to put out the blaze and find who's responsible. Resumed power to the fire suppression system has been cut. I need to get it back online to get the blaze under control. Firefly. You beat me 
once, but that was a long time ago. I believe we've met that charming pyromaniac before. Firefly. It seems Scarecrow made everyone aware that Gotham would be defenseless tonight. He's dangerous, Alfred. Keep watch for more fires. The bat creature at large on Miyagani Island. I'm going to hunt it down and take a blood sample, determine who or what it is.
Alfred, run analysis on the blood sample I just uploaded. Right you are, Master Bruce. I'm searching for possible matches now. <laughs> How you managed to get this sample is beyond me, sir. Ah, here we are. The blood is heavily mutated, but we have a partial match, a Dr. Kirk Langstrom. Search for any properties in Gotham owned or leased by Dr. Langstrom. Certainly. Uh, let me see. Ah, he and his wife lease a basement laboratory in Chinatown. I'm sending you the address. That tortured creature was once a man, Dr. Kirk Langstrom. There must be a cause for this transformation. His lab might hold the answer. Proceed with caution, sir. The creature could well be hiding in familiar surroundings. was a success. The recombinant molecule... Honey, you're doing it again. How about in English? Uh, yes, of course. Uh, sorry. So, uh, what we've done is merged the DNA of Desmodus Rotundus, uh, sorry, the, the vampire bat, into the human chain. This breakthrough could, it will, prevent and cure deafness in all humanity. How was that? Perfect, sweetie. Uh, are you getting this, honey? I think so. Is the red light on? a computer. Maybe it contains some answers. This computer stores all of Dr. Langstrom's research. Mixing his DNA with a vampire bat? That was never going to end well. If I search through his files, I may be able to create an antidote to his condition. I need to isolate the man bat's signature and remove it from Langstrom's DNA.
That's it. I've created a clean DNA sample. Now all I need to do is make him take his medicine. Alfred, I've synthesized a cure in Langstrom's lab. Now I just need to find him. Any idea where he may be hiding? He's not in control of his actions. He could be anywhere. No one knows this city better than you, Master Bruce. You'll find him. Yes, of course. Sorry. So, uh, what we've done is merge the DNA of this modus rotundus, uh, sorry, the, the vampire bat, into the human chain. This breakthrough could, it will, prevent and cure deafness in all humanity. How is that? Perfect, sweetie. Uh, are you getting that, honey? His wife? Your parents? <laughs> what is it about dead relatives that turns you into a giant rodent? That symbol on the Gamby store rooftop. A beacon or a threat? Time to find out. Oh god, what's he doing? What's he doing? He's tailing us! Keep driving! I trust you have not forgotten me, Batman. Azrael. Dark days are here, Batman. The prophecy has come true. From the ashes of Arkham City, the fires are raging, and Gotham is burning. What do you want? I can see that same fire in your eyes. Before this night is through, that fire will consume you. Gotham will need a new savior, a new guardian, a new Batman. I'm not finished just yet. You cannot carry this burden forever. I have studied you for a long time. You have a code. You will not kill. Then neither shall I. The Order has foreseen it. The time has come to pass the mantle to another warrior. To me. If you can prove your abilities, when the time is right, I'll consider it. But first, you must show you are worthy. As you wish. You have more to learn. Give me a sign when you are ready. Sir, I've captured Azrael's performance. Good work, Alfred. Run the usual physiological tests. Then am I to understand you are considering him as your successor? None of us know what will happen after tonight. I'll be in touch.
The missing fire crew's not safe on these streets. I'll start by checking Dixon Dock West. That was their last reported location. Here. Our truck was attacked. The rioters dragged us out one by one. We were separated and taken away. Please, they're gonna kill us. I'll save your crew. Wait here. I'll get a GCPD officer to pick you up. <laughs> 